sui R approaching the Bangi Catholic dispensary, the Comboni Center, where the Sister Paola is uh, working and directing the dispensary. We are going to see her, to talk and learn from her what uh, is the role of this dispensary in this uh, very populated area of uh, the ministry is sharing in this ministry the health ministry for me is sharing in the Christ healing ministry whereby I feel it is Christ that does work in me and in each of the workers here and also in the patients because our duty is only to do what we can we give the medicine, we do the history, we do investigations and so on. And also the drugs, but then Christ is the one that does the healing. And that is the fate of the people here around, because many believe they can get drugs elsewhere, yes. But sometimes they have a belief that perhaps it doesn't work. And they tell us often when they come to the sisters, dispensary, really the drugs are better, and uh, many of them, feel better and uh, that's what gives me hope. Perhaps there's something more than drugs. Perhaps the way we handle them, the way we care for them, the, I mean the, the, the love they receive from the service we give and that I feel is just more than the service but there's something of Christ healing power that attracts people also to the service we give. Okay, people say perhaps it's affordable, but that is part and partial because there are many places giving voluntary services, but here is unique. Okay, okay Paola, maybe I don't know whether you want to share something about uh, this dispensary still. It's, it's a parish dispensary. It's, uh, how does it run? How do you manage to make it function on the reading? Okay. This dispensary is under the Archdiocese of Nairobi mm -hmm. and uh, it's under the parish of Kari. We are in the parish of Kariobangi but uh, the, 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 it's the property of the Archdiocese of Nairobi mm -hmm. and uh, the management is uh, by Komboni Missionary Sisters mm -hmm. but we are directly answerable to the diocese mm -hmm. and uh, the parish is here us, I mean, uh, they support us mainly when we have issues and so on. Mm -hmm. We let them know how we are working anyway. Mm -hmm. But ideally, we are directly answerable mm -hmm. to the diocese. And we have the medical coordinator okay. who comes from the diocese. That is mm -hmm. all the medical activity in the diocese. Are you financially self supporting in this? Uh... We are trying by all means to, to, to go mm -hmm. on. Mm -hmm. from the patient's income, you mm -hmm. see, we, we ask them to pay of something uh -huh. for, the, for the services, uh -huh. uh -huh. though it's not enough for the sustaining, uh -huh. for the purchase of drugs, paying of the staff and the taxes, and then, you know, being a charitable work more than for income generating, we, we also verify emergencies, any emergency that we get, Many times the people are not ready to cope up with mm -hmm. it. Yeah. So we take the responsibility of crushing them to the parallel hospital. That is all on our back. Plus yeah. taking care of mm -hmm. maybe the street people, mm -hmm. the, the, the people in need, like those alcoholic people, when they are sent to us, it's always free of charge. Plus the poor that comes from the charity sisters of Mother Teresa. So it's a bit heavy for us to run it all with the support from the patients in mm -hmm. We have only one source of donation. The Christian Association in Italy mm -hmm. are supporting our laboratory. I see the one we are visiting now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have bought that machine mm -hmm. for the polymogram, mm -hmm. as you can see. Um, this was purchased by the Christian Association in Italy and uh, they take care of the reagents mm -hmm. and we report all the functions and number of patients that uh, mm -hmm. we examine with this full, full blood okay. cell counter mm -hmm. yearly, I mean twice or three times mm -hmm. a year we give a report to them. That's the only source of donation mm -hmm. we have. 
that comes once a year. Okay. So far since I came in two years, they have helped us once. And then occasionally, maybe people passing by, there's mm -hmm. brother hands that occasionally helps us. Okay. That is all. Otherwise, okay. we are really struggling. We struggle. So. Okay. Yeah. Because 